Want to keep up with the latest Komodo gaming videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Whoa, 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 he's shooting at us. Are you serious? All right. No, get down. Get down. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Police Enforcement VR, and yes folks, we are back once again and we're ready to fight some more crime. So today, we're going to be doing kind of a normal episode, we're going to be doing some call-outs, pulling some people over. Now, I've got to point one thing out, and this is something that I got wrong from the last episode, and yes, you can indeed equip the awesome assault rifle here. Yes. This is the thing. The only thing you have to do is put it up by your shoulder, release it, and I guess it puts it on your back? I mean, last episode I tried carrying it around, I tried putting it in the car, uh, nothing worked. Obviously, I just missed that. So, we're going to be carrying this thing here today. I'm going to go ahead and equip myself with the gun, get our uh, extra equipment. Now, I've been over all this countless times, so I'm not going to show it again. But anyways, if you did miss the last episode, we did have a pretty awesome car chase. I'll flash it up in the top right corner. And if you have any suggestions for future episodes here in Police Enforcement VR, let me know down in the comment section below. And if you're enjoying this series on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button, which I can't make a thumbs up. I can make a fist. Uh, punch the thumbs up button. Yeah, do that. All right, let's jump into this. Ah, here we go. Another night of patrol here. So I believe our surroundings are going to be changing here really soon. I saw some more pictures of the new map. It's uh, way more dense. It's way more city-like. Uh, right here, this is pretty sparse. So hopefully within the next week or two, we'll see that and we'll do another video and explore the new map. I'm really excited about that. But today, we got some business at hand. Now, I do believe we're going to take the Crown Vic today. Uh, last episode, we did take the SUV, so I'd like to swap it in between episodes. There we go. Now, it is worth noting, we do have a new driving system, which I did test it out, and I must say, it's a lot better than the, uh, the fighter pilot stick shift thing that we were doing earlier. So let's go and hop into here. Suggest the camera. Okay. All right. So to drive the car, it's now triggers. So you can sit here and I don't know why did my hand get stuck behind the... That was weird. All right. So you can grab the, the wheel and you release everything, but you can hold your trigger here and that will actually make it drive forward. So let's go ahead and crank that. There we go. So check that out. That's actually a lot better than trying to like move the stick around and try to get that all correct. Uh, so yeah. We got triggers, so I can sit here and like, I don't know, do some sort of telekinesis and say, go car! Oh, that feels a lot better. Alright, so we are in service right now. We're going to go try to take some calls here today. Uh, hopefully we'll get some call outs, maybe something different. Uh, but if not, we'll find somebody to pull over. There's tons of criminals here in Polk County for some reason. Like, seems like everybody has some sort of warrant or something. It's actually quite weird. Alright, we're at one of my favorite spots. You know, we're actually going to go somewhere new today. Uh, there is actually some houses and stuff uh, back. You've got the highway, which it's kind of hard for me to point now that we're, uh, we're throttling with our fist. Uh, but there's a highway, uh, there's some houses, there's a gas station on the other side of town here. So uh, I do think we're going to head out that way, not unless we get a call first. Uh, because that could be an area maybe we can explore, maybe we can find some criminals out there. Some people doing some uh, not so good things. All right, this car in front of us is driving really erratically. Like you just saw there, could not stay like in its lane. I mean, what are we doing here? What's going on? Let's just follow them a little bit longer here. Look at this, they're coming to a stop. I, I haven't lit you up yet. I mean, I'm going to, hold on, it's loading to the next section. All right, let's go ahead. We're right by the gas station here. Let's go ahead and light them up here. See if we can get them pull over by the gas station. Obviously, probably have an impaired person here. Come on. Get over. Get. You know, I don't even know why I expect them to do this. Because, honestly, you can't even stay in your own lane. All right, are we really going to do this stop in the middle of the street? Hold on, let's see if I can get them to pull over here. Pull your vehicle over, you dingus. Hold on, let's get on this side. Maybe they think we're supposed to be off to the other side. There we go. A little bit further. Come on. Come on, you can do it! Uh, uh, I'm gonna just rip this person out of the car. I'm pretty sure somebody's been drinking tonight. Alright, we'll just have to have traffic go around us here. Uh, we're gonna go ahead. You know what? We should probably go ahead and run the plate first. Seems like everybody's vehicle is either stolen or 
has got some sort of issue here, so uh, let's go plate here. What is the plate? It's 27H335. All right. Whoa. Whoa. Everything's valid. Registration's valid. Insurance valid. Not stolen. Okay. Well, we're off to kind of a good start. All right. Well, I don't have any suspicion to believe that the person's up to anything bad, except for they might be intoxicated. Let's go ahead and make contact uh, with the suspect. All right. What do we have here? Have you been drinking? Come on. Yeah, I've had maybe one or two. Okay. Well, I saw you weaving up and down the road there. I uh, couldn't... Uh, it didn't look like you could hold your own lane. Uh, how about you give me some credentials? Come on. All right. I'm not going to touch you. Why would that be your answer for credentials? All right. Uh, we'll probably wind up pulling this person out. They did acknowledge that they've had one or two drinks, but one or two drinks to a drunk person could be like a pitcher or something way more extreme. All right, Lonnie Cruz... Got a misdemeanor warrant, a valid, that's actually a concealed weapons permit, I believe. Uh, threat level medium. All right. Well, this could go either way. I mean, we've already had a good start here. They have acknowledged that, yes, uh, we are drinking, but we'll see what happens when we tell them to get out of the vehicle. Let's go ahead, get the old taser ready here. I don't know why I can't grab it. There we go. All right, let's get the taser ready. Get them to pull out, of, get out of the car here. All right, Lonnie. Unfortunately, you do have a misdemeanor warrant. How about you step out of the vehicle for me? No. No. Yes, officer. Illegal in the vehicle. I didn't ask that, but... Okay, so you have illegal things in the vehicle. All right, let's go open the door. <laughs> Exit vehicle. Exit vehicle. Come on, Lonnie. Get out of the vehicle. Exit vehicle, come here. I don't think he's going to catch the voice command for this. Let's go ahead and pull up a menu here, see if we can get him to uh, command us. All right, driver exit. No, nope. how about that one? Driver exit. Driver. E All right, we're pulling him out of the car here. How about you? Uh, come on, get up for me here. I don't want to. I don't want to force you out come of the on. car. Come on, buddy. Are we gonna really? Are you serious? Are we really gonna do this today? All right. Uh, Lonnie, Lonnie, Lonnie. What are we doing? All right, turn on. We gotta go. All right, so Lonnie has decided to run on us, and Lonnie has stopped again. Did he think I told him he was free to go? He's obviously intoxicated. All right. Are we going to sit here or are we going to run again? Oh, buddy, buddy, buddy. What are we doing? All right, let's go and get out of the car. All right, Lonnie, we're going to give you one more chance. Get out of the vehicle. No. Get out of the vehicle. I'm going to tase you. Get out of the vehicle. No. All right, hands up. Okay. All right, that works too. Uh, hands up. Okay. There we go. He says he's doing a little freak out here. Doesn't really matter. Uh, we're going to go ahead and grab him real quick. Come here. Whoa, 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 he's got a gun. He's got a gun. Are you serious? No, 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 no. Oh, crud. Come on, grab that. Where's he going? Lonnie. Oh, crud. Oh, jeez. Oh, and he's running. All right, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He's shooting at us. Are you serious? All right. No, nope, get down. Get down. What the heck? Why is it? Oh, I missed. Oh, no, no, no. Get down. There he goes. He's down. Are you kidding me? Okay. Well, it's been a while since we shot somebody. Oh, boy. All right, we're good. Did we get hit? No, we didn't get hit here. All right, we're going to call medical here. What the heck, Lonnie? Hey, go to your vehicle. Or get out of here. All right. Okay. Uh, Lonnie's down. Lonnie looks like a pretzel right now. I'm not really sure. Like, he came running at me, too. Uh, I don't think I really had much of an option there. He did fire shots at us. Uh, fortunately, I don't think I was hit here. Uh, we need to close out the street here. We need to get medical here immediately. All right, Lonnie. What in the heck? Is he still... I don't believe. He's not going to, like, rise from the dead and zombie us, is he? All right, let's go ahead and get medical. Dispatch medical. Dispatch medical. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Hold on. I'll put this here. Let's go ahead and go to commands. Make sure I got this dispatch. All right. Okay. Medical request. 
All right, here we go. All right, they're going to get Lonnie to the hospital. Of course, <laughs> Lonnie took a couple shots there. Oh, crazy people. All right, so we need to, uh, we got the road closed here. We need to go ahead and search Lonnie's car. Oh, boy. Like, really? All right, well, he said he did have something illegal in here, so let's see what we can find. What was Lonnie up to? Okay, nothing so far. Gonna squeeze between our vehicles here. Can that open? Anything? No? Huh. Alright, maybe he was just saying things. Oh, seriously? Pull away. Can't you see police activity going on here? You know, I want to say that was probably our first actual shootout. Well, actually, I think the first episode we had somebody shoot at us. What is this? Nah, possible drugs. Okay. So, that's obviously what Lonnie was, uh... Hiding. All right. Well, I do know the uh, the little test kit works. We'll uh, test that out. But yeah, I, I do recall we did get into a shootout the first episode, but like that was one. That was return fire. That was uh, pretty crazy. All right. I've never worked one of these before. I think the only thing you have to do, basically, hold on, let's put that away. I don't know why I'm having problems. Okay, there we go. I can move now. Yeah, I think you just basically put this uh, end on uh, the possible drugs here. So let's go. Uh, positive. Okay. Oh, we got a call here, too. We'll see what that's all about. See if it's something that needs our immediate attention. Or if we can wait a second here. Let's go and get the evidence bag out. All right, evidence bag. There we go. That's in there. All right, we'll stick that in the back of the car. All right, we're going to do a tow request. What is a call real quick? Uh, hold on. It's getting here. Where's a call out? Suspicious vehicle. All right. All right, we'll catch that here in a second, hold on. Dispatch tow request. There we go. All right. Vehicle's gone. We're going to go ahead. I know this situation would probably be a little bit... Did they just crash in front of me? Ugh. All right, was that... What area is our suspicious vehicle in? Zone 4. Is that... Zone 4. Is this Zone 4? Hold on, we're going to accept this call out real quick. Go boom. All right, it says it's in zone one. We'll keep that call out active. We're gonna go see what the heck just happened over here. Uh, so while we're investigating the area, this uh, person just got rear-ended here, and she appears to be on the throttle. Are you kidding me? You okay, ma'am? Okay, she looks okay. This idiot's still uh, holding on the gas here, huh? And let's go ahead and approach him. Sir, have you been drinking? No. Yes, officer. All right. Uh, I'd like to get you pulled off the highway here. We're not going to get him out of the car here. All right. Exit vehicle. Come here. Come on, exit the vehicle. Uh, driver exit. There we go. No. All right. No, no, come on. Come here. Come here. Come here. I would like to get us out of the road. Come here. All right, come here. Uh, you know, we'll march him back. All right, why don't you go ahead and give me your credentials at least? Okay. All right, thank you. All right, and we blow in that. Hold on, let's see if we can get around. Let's go ahead and tell us if he's a uh, full-blown drunk here. Let's see, go ahead and put that there. Blow, or are you drunk? There's a way to make this work. Breathalyzer test conducted. It says zero. Hold on, try that again. Okay. What? Okay. You said, are you just crazy? Okay, maybe he just wants to go to jail. He says he was drunk. Uh, or he's been drinking, and he blew a zero, so obviously no. All right, we might just be able to give him a ticket. Let's go run this real quick. Uh, we still need to search for that suspicious vehicle. Honestly, this could just be a mistake here on his part. It's Mr. Brent Ward. All right, let's go ahead and look him up. Uh, we might just let him go. Or, of course, let's call it a tow truck or something. People get a little too distracted when it comes to police stops on the side of the road, and they stop paying attention to what they're doing. Which is a little annoying to me. It's like the onlooker situation every time a crash happens. Brent Ward, okay, doesn't have a valid CC permit, which I don't think that's really a thing. Um, hmm, he's got a misdemeanor warrant. All right, well, we're grabbing him. All right, Mr. Ward, you seem to be stuck against the car here, uh, but I'm going to ask you to... Okay, hands up. Okay. Hands up. Okay. All right, I can't move this dude for some reason, huh? Let's go boom, boom. Okay. Come on. Okay. No, okay. Don't tell me. Okay. To... Stop saying okay, please. No. You're... Really? That's your response is no? Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Okay. Okay. Okay. Get back here. Okay. I cannot move this guy for some reason. Turn around. Okay. Turn around. O okay. Okay. Come here. Okay. Come here. He's got like a magical force field up against his car. You know, I wonder if this would help. I know this is a little bit uh, outside my job parameters and a little bit inhumane, but I think he's stuck, so let's assist him. Okay. Yep. All right, so I think we got him away from his car now. Yeah, I still can't move him. Like, here's the box to move him. He, he somewhat turns, okay. but he doesn't go with me. Come here. Okay. Yeah, he's glitched. All right. Okay. Dispatch request medical. He ain't gonna disappear. All right, Bryn, have a good day. You don't have your vehicle anymore, so you're not really that much of a danger. Uh, we'll let the other things deal with that. All right, we need to get into the car. Uh, there's a suspicious vehicle around here somewhere. Oh, it's going to be one of those nights, isn't it? All right, turn that off. We accepted this call out, did we not? Okay. Let's go call out. All right, did it disappear? Suspicious vehicle. Uh, we're in zone four. This is, uh, it's going to be zone one, so it's really over there by the, uh, kind of by the police station, uh, slash highway area. So we'll see if we can pick this up. Sometimes these calls are, they're a little awkward or they're a little hard to pick up. All right, so I didn't see him on the loop there. We're going to pull off over here, see if we have any vehicles. I mean, there's always vehicles kind of parked over here. So you really, uh, you really never know what you're going to run into. Okay, so it's going to switch to zone two here at one of these streets. I don't think it would be on the street. Yeah, that's the police station street right there. Don't see it over there. Okay. Come on, there's got to be somebody around here somewhere that knows something. The vehicle over here on the left side, that vehicle's normally always here. So I don't think that's our, uh, that's not our vehicle, I don't believe. Come on. There's a couple vehicles over there. Okay, we're going to take a right right here. This will probably... It's going to put us in zone two here in a second. Uh, let's take a right right here. Uh, not seeing anything, to be honest with you. Got a couple vehicles over there to the right. But no, I'm not, I'm not picking anything up here. Might have just declined this call, say we can't find the vehicle. All right, we've searched this area out. I'm not, I'm not seeing a car here that is picking up. So, fortunately, we're gonna have to, uh, we have to deny that call. Let's see where this person goes. Okay, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna deny the call here and just wait for another one. All right, we have found a suspect here. We got somebody with a an out tail light here. Also kind of going fast. Oh, yeah, kind of weaving there through the neighborhood. Let's go ahead and line them up here. See if we can get them to pull over for us here. And see, uh, talk about that little out tail light there. Uh, come on, pull over. Come on, get over to the side. There we go. That, that'll probably do. It's going to make sure our spotlight's on. Cool. That. Okay, that's not bad. All right, let's go ahead and run the plate. It's going to be 24F256. Return stolen vehicle. Wouldn't you know it. All righty. I guess we're going to get another one of these tonight. Oh, boy. All right. I'm watching some movement in the, a uh, little bit of movement in the wheel over there. I don't know if they're getting ready to run here. All right, back to the car here. I don't have any other option but to take this bad boy out. I'm out of pistol ammo. Plus, it is a stolen vehicle, so we'll be ready here. Let's go and get, approach the vehicle here. All right, let's go. Driver exit. Come on. Driver exit. Uh, do you know this is a stolen vehicle? I need to tell you that. All right, get out. All right, we need you to get you out of the car. This is a stolen vehicle. Come on, out of the car. No, 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 you're not gone. Come on, Come on get out of the car. Get out of the car. Come on, doofus, get out of the car. No. Come on. Come on, get out of the car. Okay. Get on the ground. Okay. Okay, hands up. Okay. All right, do you have anything illegal on you? No. Nothing. What are you doing? Have you been drinking? No. No, okay. Do you mind if I search the vehicle? Come on. It doesn't really matter what you want. All right, put your hands up. Okay. Let's go and pat him down. You son of a. Oh, no, 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 no. 
No. Hands up. Right, slap those on right there. Ah, okay. No, no, no. All right. He's got a... Oh. Seriously? I think I've been shot. Yeah, I got shot. Are you kidding me? Come on. We went clean so many episodes, and now everybody's trying to shoot me. Hey, we got to use the assault rifle. All right. On. All right. Jeez. Yep. Where's the gun at? All right. He pulled out a gun. On. Let's see. Where is it at? Is it in his hand? There it is. Okay, yeah, he did have a weapon. Alright, that's the second time tonight we've been shot at. I'm just going to put this away. Oh, boy. Dispatch. Dispatch medical request. Uh, let's see if we can search him. Alright, let's go with the medical request here. He doesn't have anything on him. Alright, let's go and search the vehicle now. Wow, these people are really, really aggressive tonight. Uh, this is actually really surprising. I forgot how many we arrested last episode. Didn't get any cop chases tonight, but we got some shootouts. What were you hiding? I didn't even get credentials on this person. Uh, we didn't get to that point. We got to the point where they wanted to pull a gun on us. Um, pop that open again. Okay, nothing there. Let's check passenger. Alright. Nope. Nope, nothing there. Okay, nothing in the vehicle. Oh boy. Yep. It's just gonna be one of those days. Alright. Let's go ahead. Dispatch tow request. Oh boy. Yep. We're hurt. Alright. Just gonna put that away. That's some really. It's a crazy night. I thought maybe this was gonna be slow when we first started out, but nope. It is definitely not. Alright. I know I can use those. I'll get one more out here. Uh, maybe I have to put this away. Can I use this on me? There we go. It still doesn't heal you, which is kind of odd, but nonetheless. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to call it an episode here. This is crazy. Uh, don't, please don't tell me it's like a shootout call or something. Uh, just real quick. Check it. Suspicious person. We'll let another unit take it. I've been shot at enough tonight. But anyways, I think it's going to wrap it up for this episode of Police Enforcement. Let me know what you guys want to see down in the comment section below, what you want to see me do or attempt. Uh, I had some pretty cool calls. I had some shootouts, so that was new. But yeah, hope you guys have a great day, and we will see you guys next time in the Polk County Sheriff's Department.